you know, the first and foremost thing that we are working on, which is our flagship feature for, for the next uh, versions, is what is called the resource manager. You know, you need the resources, the content at your fingertips. Every time you are using a tool, you need those, those resources. Otherwise, it's of no use. Uh, you have to get the resources from the web someplace. You have to get it from uh, you know, some, some place in the cloud. You, you should be able to do it just like that. And to increase that usability, we are now introducing the new resource manager. And here to tell you more about the resource manager is Core Technologies Manager, Hughes Suffolk. Thank you, Biplab. So as Biplab mentioned, so we all know how content is important to your workflow. In fact, a large set of resources is available to you, vector user, in the form of content library from many different sources. This includes application content, vector installer, vector service select portal, user library, workgroup libraries, and many others. However, finding and selecting the desired resource to use or interacting with the libraries in general can be very challenging. The resource browser has been the primary interface for interacting with resources in Vectorworks for many years. However, with the ever-increasing number of libraries and resources, the time has come to turn a page into the future. And that future is the resource manager. The resource manager is the brand new, powerful, and intuitive interface. It will provide you with direct access to all of your resources at a single point. You will be able to browse the full set of libraries available for Vectorworks. And guess what? That includes online libraries such as Vector Service Select libraries. Browsing and navigating in a resource manager is similar to navigating a standard OS file explorer. It supports multiple view modes, an additional panel for high resolution preview, and a dirty panel for data tag and record. A powerful search functionality allows you to quickly find the resources you need anywhere. Tag can be attached to any resources facilitating searching and filtering. And all type of resources can now be organized into folders. <laughs> resources can be edited and created in any open file, but also in any file from editable libraries such as user libraries and workgroup libraries. And moving resources between files and folders can be accomplished using simple drag and drop operations. That's really cool. Resources can also be applied to objects directly from the resource manager. And online resources will be downloaded from the web on demand. And not only that, we are also bringing the content at the user fingertip. What that means is that the resource browser control is the new interface that will provide you with direct access to the relevant content right at the point of use within the tool and command. And you'll notice that this new control is similar in feeling and uh, browsing capability or search functionality as the resource manager. And I can tell you, managing resources with the resource manager in Vectorworks has never been easier. And we're very excited about that future. Thank you. Thank you. So you remember, like we used to have, uh, in the, I think in the year of 2000, we used to have object browser and resource palette. And uh, you know, the, the parametric objects used to appear in the object browser, and the resources used to be on the resource palette. And then we combined that together, which, is, which we called resource browser. And at that time, we had probably like five resources. And now we have you know, 25 different resources that, are, that we are using, different styles of walls and roofs and slabs, you know, plants, you know, all the different uh, uh, entertainment design community, all the objects that we use for lighting devices. It's just amazing. And it was becoming very difficult for a resource browser to control and search and, uh, and, and do all the operations that are required for the management from a small little browser like that. So we just expanded it and made it much, much better. So I think it will be one of the best features 
in the next versions.